ze vlot maar. Wow! Hey, what's up guys? Uh, I just finished editing a video I made from a tour I did a few days ago with my cousin Andre. We had the goal of catching some arctic char and we wanted to uh, cook them and show you how we do it. Uh, we were fishing a river or a part of a river called Brúará. So this is a map of Iceland. Reykjavík is here. Um, and Brúará is not that far away. About an hour's drive. It is exactly here. You can see it there. Um, so yeah. I hope you enjoy the video. This is one of few uh, geothermal power plants here in Iceland. We're here in the middle of a lava field. About to drive up to Hellisheiði. So yeah, down there in the far we can see the largest river in Iceland. This river is called Ölvusá. This is where it meets the ocean goes down to the ocean. Down there is the town of Kveragerði and through Kveragerði uh, a river called Varmá runs through the town and um, it is fed by uh, plenty of small geysers that we can see here in these hills. Maybe you can see the steam coming up there. Varmá is known in the fishing society or community here in Iceland for um, having a lot of big fish as well as having all the freshwater species that we have in Iceland. So um, it is a favorite with uh, anglers here and um, once again up there in the valley you can see steam coming up from numerous places. These are all uh, geysers, natural hot water. This is Varmo here. Doesn't have a lot of water in it usually, but once again, the fish grow huge. Uh, the warm water has a lot to do with that, of course. So here we can see the largest freshwater river called Sojið, uniting with Kvitá river, which is a glacial river and together they form the largest river in the country. There we can see uh, two or three people fishing. you bastard it's looking pretty good a little windy today but the uh, Brúará the river we're fishing today slows down here the current is heavier a little bit further off it is deep one of the bigger freshwater rivers in the country not the biggest but uh, it's gonna be a challenge a lot of upstreaming but the conditions are good, so hopefully we will make it happen.
Det är lika med han. André. Ja, toppboll. Toppboll hookup after a pretty slow day. <laughs> Wow! No! Oh! <laughs> Nice one. You take the throttle. Oh yeah. Get care. Too bad I lost mine. <laughs> Well done. Feels good. Shit, I've lost my... Perfect for eating. Andre is just retrieving uh, the fish he caught. Arctic char is... My personal favorite uh, fish for eating, it's super healthy, it's related to the salmon, so um, it has all the good fat acids, omegas, super healthy. Can I see in your back? Three nice jar. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, so uh, this is the day after the fishing tour. I'm outside my uh, cousin's house, Andre, who uh, caught the three char yesterday, and we're gonna cook them up. Hi, Nala. So uh, you measured them around 600 grams, right? Yeah, six, seven hundred. So that's a um, little bit over a pound, almost one and a half pound. The fourth flat. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So you got some seasoning in the bowl there. What what do you have there? It's uh, sugar, salt, and lemon. So I'm gonna coat this and let it stay for 20 minutes. Then it's going to be sweet for another 20 minutes. And that's it. Good 
sé ég allir þessu og óskoðast að Hvað veldu í tíma? Þetta er með þetta Já If you could only smell this Then you're gonna vacuum it, right? Yes, I'll seal it and leave it in a sous-vide for 20 minutes. Leave it, what, what did you call this device? Sous-vide. Sous-vide? Jeez! Skorta er annað. 